Hello everyone, welcome to Geeks for Geeks. In this video, we are going to see two methods of renaming a column. So first of all, let's import pandas. So import pandas as pd. Let's run it. So my pandas is imported. Now first of all, let's create our data frame. So I'm going to create my data frame using a dictionary. So let's create a dictionary called data and it is going to contain the names of the students who belong to different different branches. Let's name the keys as a branch. So I'm going to take first branch as computer science engineering and let's create a list of the students who belongs to these branches. So the first one is Raj, then second is Karan, then Preeti, then Rohit. So these four students belong to CSE branch. Now let's create another branch called electronics engineering so ECE then the names of the students Rahul Varun and Parag and let the fourth student be Asif and make sure the array's length is same in every key right and we have to close this Now let's take these two branches and let's create a data frame. So df is equal to pd dot data frame provide the data and let's run this by showing the df. So we are having two columns CSC and EC and we are having the names of the students who belong to these branches. Now I want to rename I let's say the teacher got a mistake and uh, she is telling that I want to rename CSC as mechanical these four students belongs to belong to mechanical branch not CSE right so let's do it so we can do it by calling an inbuilt function in pandas and let's create a different data frame called df2 and in this data frame we have to use df df dot rename this is an inbuilt function and you have to name the columns so we have to provide a columns parameter the key and I want to name CSE CSE as mech right and you can just run this by le and let's show the df2 so now i can see that my uh, cse branch or cse column name is changed to mechanical right now you can do this by not creating a different data frame right as you can see we have created df2 but you can do it without creating a df2 and how can you do it just remove this and you can provide another parameter called in place is equal to true that means it is going to update the df only it is not going to create a, it is not going to create another data frame it is just going to update your df right now your df will be updated let's run df and i can see that mechanical is there not csc right so this was the first method that is using a rename function and now let's see the different method that is using df.columns so now i can see that in my data frame mechanical and EC branch are there right let's create a new data frame let's use the same data and let's add one more branch mechanical let's provide the names as Gaurav Amish Ashwin and let's take Prerna And let's create df3 is equal to pd dot data frame provide the data and let's show df3 so we are having three columns now I want to uh, rename my mechanical as electrical so EE -E, that is triple E I want to rename so you can do it by this rename function also and another thing is you can rename using df3 that is my data frame df3 dot columns and you can provide a list to it so i want to name my csc as csc only my ec as ece only and the third thing i want to rename as mechanical to triple e that is electrical right run it and when i will run df3 now i can see that mechanical is renamed to triple e so using this columns you can rename multiple columns 
Now let's do a quick revision of these two methods. So revision and let's create a new data frame called scores and here I'm going to use cricket players. Let's take Virat and let's say his math scores are 99 runs, then 88 runs, then 67 runs and 90 runs. Let's take one more player, Dhoni. And let's say his scores are 66, then 99, then 100, then 66 again. Right. Let's take one more player called Rohit. And let's say his scores are 101, then 102, then 77, then 34. And let's create a DF is equal to PD dot data frame. Provide the dictionary show the df and run it so we can see that there are three columns now using first method that is rename so df dot rename i want to rename provide a dictionary right so we are doing this we are doing that same thing we have to provide a dictionary to columns so df dot rename provide a dictionary to columns parameter and that dictionary is going to contain the previous column name let's say Virat is now changed to Rhino and you can change multiple column names let's take I want to rename Dhoni as Kunal right and I can run this and I can see that Virat is changed to Raina and Dhoni is changed to Punal. Now let's use second method columns. So df dot columns is equal to provide a list. Now my df is this, not that previous one, right? So I have to rename now Raina as let's take that thing back. So Virat. Let's let's take first column as Dhoni second column as Virat and third column let's take Rohit only. Now I can show DF and I can see that Dhoni, Virat and Rohit are the new column names. So I hope you like this video and if you have any suggestions and any feedback you want to give us you can do that in the comment section. Thank you for watching this video.